Once again, we briefly depart from our chronology of UUCOC history in anticipation of our 60th anniversary on May 23rd to recognize that today is Mother's Day. To help us celebrate, Sally Jones, a mother figure to many of us, will again be in our pulpit. As you probably know, 40 years before it was to become an official U.S. holiday in 1914, Julia Ward Howe, a prominent American abolitionist, feminist, poet, author of The Battle Hymn of the Republic, and a Unitarian, issued her inspired Mother's Day proclamation, which called upon mothers of all nationalities to band together to promote the amicable settlement of international issues, the great and general interest of peace. She had nursed and tended the wounded during the Civil War and worked with the widows and orphans of soldiers on both sides, realizing that the effects of war go far beyond the killing of the soldiers in battle. While Mother's Day has presently lost much of its early edge for justice, our country is still engaged in devastating and costly wars abroad, and many of our own communities are torn apart by violence. This is a good time for Mother's Day to return to its roots. Rather than buying candy, flowers, or an extravagant dinner, in the spirit of Julia Ward Howe's original call, this occasion can be a time to again dedicate ourselves to justice and peace. What better way to honor our mothers?